Lactantius Epitome Divinardrum Institutionum, Episode 24. Orpheus, Principalem Deum Dicit, qui coilum solemque cum caeteris astris, qui terdram qui mario condiderit. Lactantius is now giving examples of pagan prophets and poets who talked about the true God. Orpheus, Principalem Deum, the principal God or the chief God, says, or we might say that Orpheus says that there is, there's an essa implicit here, Orpheus claims that there is a principal God, a chief God, who, qui, the sky and the sun, solemque, together with the other stars, who, the earth, qui terdram, who, the seas, maria, established or created or built. Remember that condo condere is a common way to express creation. It is similar, it's a synonym of creare, it means to establish or to put in place. So we see the subject is Orpheus. We have dicit the verb as a third singular, present indicative active. And then principalem deum is oratio obliqua, indirect statement, with an implicit essa, as I've said. That there is a chief god, a principal or leading god, principalem essa deum. And then we have a number of qui clauses. Each one of these qui clauses, qui, 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 the three of them, have the perfect subjunctive condiderate as their verb. As I've said, it is from condo condera. So this would be called by grammarians a relative clause of characteristic. So Orpheus claims that there is a chief god who is the kind of god that, and this indicates that Orpheus, according to Lactantius, doesn't know the god's identity, but he is the sort of god that did these things. He built and he established the heavens, coilum, that's accusative, neuter singular accusative, solemque, and the sun, masculine singular accusative, together with the other stars, caeteris astris, neuter plural, and ablative with cum. Moreover, he is a god who, qui condiderit terdram, who built or created the earth. Teram is feminine singular and accusative, so we have the heavens, the earth, and third, qui mardria condiderit, who created the seas, neuter, plural, and accusative, these three realms, the heavens, the earth, and the seas. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the lesson, please press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment.